all about the clap back. Get your boss whack, premieres funeral on Snapchat. Ha! You now tuned into the bad guy. I make a movie out of him. I leave him flat on his face with shit oozing out of niggas wanna stunt. I know what to do about him. Maybe they get him. Once good, y'all, Fist Vegas, the hardest force of sports. Go ahead, hit that like button and subscribe to the Fisk, you know why you at it. Y'all know what time it is. If you ain't with it, you best get with it. Now let's rock. Listen. Thank God that the Patriots signed Cam Newton. Because if the Patriots ain't signed Cam Newton, they, they, they wouldn't win six games. I'm convinced. They went and win six games. This, this, this is this is ridiculous. This is this is all the way ridiculous. Just for the simple fact that Brian Hoyer by himself, okay. Brian Hoyer by himself cost the Patriots at least two field goals at minimum. The dude, okay. So let me get it straight. The Patriots are running a no huddle play, right? It's like six, seven seconds left when he calls hike. You have to be aware enough to know that you have to either throw the ball out of bounds or you can't take a sack. This idiot, right before the half, takes a sack with no timeouts in the, in the clock expires. That's at least three points. Even before that, this idiot threw a ball in the flat. Like, it, bro, you, you don't like the 12-yard line. He threw a ball into the flat, like, take some end zone shots, you idiot. And then, okay, so that's right before the half. Then in the second half, and this is what got his ass benched. In the second half, he's in the end zone, and he turns the ball over again. That's another, f bro, that's another three points that he cost the team. You was inside the 20 on consecutive drives. Brian Hoyer turns the ball over. So the Patriots, Belichick ain't, Belichick ain't gonna take that shit. So Brian Hoyer inside the 20 on two, two drives calls the Patriots points. His ass gets benched. And in comes this motherfucker still. <laughs> in comes the motherfucker still. In comes Jared Stittle. Okay. It, it, no. <laughs> Bro, this ain't it, man. I'm sorry, Jay Stiddle. He ain't the vibes either, man. This dude Stiddle come in like looking like a whole bum. Now, granted, the only thing I will give Stiddle, the only, or should I call him Stid? Okay, it's Bella. Shall let's go Stid, or as I should call him Stid. Only credit I give Stidham is I needed a touchdown from the Kill Harry. And he did get Nikhil Harry a touchdown, so I, I'll give him some kind of credit for that. But other than that, this bum is 5 for 13, 60 yards, a touchdown, and two picks. And he only played a quarter. His motherfucker threw two picks in a quarter. Okay, so we not, we're not we not doing this. Okay, Stidham is a, Stidham is a whole bum. Brian Hoyer is a, a, a half a bum. Okay, Brian Hoyer is a half a bum. Jared Stidham is a whole bum. Thank God they signed Cam Newton. Okay, because if the Patriots didn't have Cam Newton, they season would be over. It, 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 it'd be over. And at this point, Cam Newton going to get the bag from Belichick. There's no way Belichick don't throw like 20-something million dollars a year at Cam Newton. Cam Newton is not going to get $35, $40 million from anybody. He's just not. I don't think anybody's giving Cam Newton 35 to 40 million dollars. But I'm confident Belichick going to throw him at least 25. Belichick going to throw him at least 25. At least. He'll at least give him Tom Brady money. What is Tom Brady getting? Tom Brady's getting 25 million a year from... Um, he signed a two-year $50 million contract with the Buccaneers, right? Something like that. It was a 60. Tom Brady getting around 25, 27. I think Belichick will give him Tom Brady money. Yeah, I think that's fair, but there's no way in hell Belichick is 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 going to go into a game with Brian Hoyer and Stidham as his only two options. It's, it's, that that's not going to happen. This dude Stidham out here throwing all kind of bad balls. As far as Belichick goes, he's the he's the ultimate cheat code, man. 
if he has Cam Newton, they win this game. I'm sticking by my Patriots winning the Super Bowl prediction. There's no way, bro, because Belichick is the ultimate cheat code. Look at the defensive game plan he had. The Patriots got robbed of a, of a pick six because the dude is either a pick six or a fumble six. One way or the other, Mahomes turns the ball over in the second quarter. I don't know if it was a it was an interception or a fumble, but one way or the other, Mahomes turns the ball over for for a touchdown that they that they ruled the play overs. They ruled the play dead. So that was points right there. They already talked about the two turn the two fucking point the, the the two field goals that Brian Hoyer cost the Patriots, and then the dude stood on and they're throwing pick sixes. So you know if the if the Patriots have Cam Newton. There's no doubt in my mind they're beating the Chiefs. They're beating the Chiefs. The next time the Patriots in the, in, in the Chiefs play in the playoffs, Cam Newton will beat the Chiefs. I'm 99% confident that Cam Newton's beating the Chiefs. Edelman ain't it. Edelman is trash. That dude Edelman drop everything to come his way. Edelman is so bad that he literally dropped the ball and it fell into a tight end hand. There's a tight end on the Patriots that literally has a catch that because because he was smart enough to pick it off the floor because Edelman can't catch. So I mean I don't know what they're gonna do about wide receivers. Robert Kraft need to swallow his pride and call Antonio Brown, but that's none of my business. As far as the Chiefs go, man, Mahomes didn't look too good, but uh, nobody looks good versus Belichick. You know what I'm saying? Mahomes really didn't look too good, but it's it's Belichick, bro. It's freaking Belichick. I mean, what do you expect them to look like? That's what I'm saying. Like, I'm sitting in my live stream with Tyson, aka Master at Work. Shout out to his YouTube channel. I'm sitting in my live stream last night doing the game with him, and he's like, "Bro, my Patriots don't stand a chance. We don't have Cam Newton." I'm like, "Bro, you have Belichick. Anytime you have Belichick, you stand a chance, man. There's no such thing." Is having Belichick as a head coach and you go into a game and you don't stand a chance. Belichick defense was gonna be ready. Belichick's defense came to play. Travis Kelsey didn't really get loose. Tyree Kill had that one touchdown on the goal line, but for the most part, Stephon Gilmore was locking locking stuff down. Nothing really nothing special really happened. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> nothing special. Belichick D, man. You need Belichick defense. All them players opt out. All them randoms. I can't even name the Patriot defense, but they get stuff done. That's just a fact. The Patriots defense just gets stuff done. But anyway, that's it. That's all. Subscribe to the unit if you rock it with me. My name is Fist Vegas, and I approve this message.